If I can't keep my head held high enough, I'll just speak love and watch the smiles come. Bring my spirits up. There's some shit I like to fix, but I still know that I'm blessed. The time has come to start the monstrosity of the office, planting room, craft room, extra clothes, shipping room, essential oil room, you name it, everything goes on in here. And um, we got a bunch of stuff because we had to clear dad's house out so things are piled in here. So I'm going to just start on this today, this project. I'm just going to work little by little by little over time. Just want to give you an overview of this room. Boxes stacked to the ceiling. That's where Bobby uh, grows his uh, lion's mane mushrooms. So this is a growing room as well. Essential oil stuff everywhere. Office stuff. Exercise stuff. Just, yeah. So today's the day we're going to start. Like this little pile, I already know I don't need. That mummy doesn't work good. And that other stuff, I don't need. I, I would keep these things for like for paint or like glue and stuff, but I have plenty of others, so I'm going to be more particular. More stuff from Dad's. i got to box those up. Wall hanging box, basically. They're specialized for that. And Bobby's got all his treatment chemicals in that corner. This room serves a lot of purposes. Here's stuff already headed for the teardrop, hopefully, that'll fit on the little shelves nicely. I want to make sure I have all my essential oil and herbal books with us because that'll be the medicine when we're on the road. In October, we're going to be on the road for three weeks. So we're going to do lots of little practice runs between now and then. So I'm going to get to work in here now. All right, moving right along. I'm going to put the stuff that's going to be designated camping stuff in this tub. Look, he found one of those old, actually has the coils, the off for the bugs. Let's get this stuff in there just until next time. This is part of the dog stuff. Get my hiking boots in here. My Doc Martin hiking boots. Here's the thing with the essential oil herbal books. Keep those tidy in there. And I want to find a way. Hopefully, I ordered some man hooks today. I want to find a way to put this rack up for hanging stuff without messing up the walls in there and then possibly hang up this hook too we'll see so these in here stuff on that. <laughs> sorry these are getting stuck okay and this is my toiletries bag let's talk about me i've had this forever that's where i always put like, my deodorant and my toothpaste and all that so this will be on standby Snack bag, we always have munchies in that. It's an insulated bag. It's just, you know, it's, it might be kept hot or cold. Then we have our linen bags, packed with blankets and stuff. And then I'm going to take this shelving and this stuff for camping, put it in there, and then I'm finally getting rid of this Mickey Mouse that we've owned since the 90s. I'm going to start throwing a black bag of stuff that's selling, and then these I'm going to get into this uh, picture packing box. Moving right along here. You know how it is, you have to tear a room apart to get it put back together. I've got a bunch of the camping stacked here. I found my hats and I've never liked this hat. I'm gonna donate this hat. Oops, I didn't mean that to, I'll have to untangle the lay off of there. This can possibly use for toting stuff out. To camping this is pillows that go out on the day bed that we just don't use anymore i'm gonna sell these old frames some of them are antique this hat i will use for a sun hat for camping though and i still haven't put these in here i'm gonna wait to put those in that uh framing packaging box until i know all the stuff i need to put in there most of that's dad stuff the cardboard will go to my son because his only uh heat source is the wood burning i have Nested a lot of the boxes in here. They're going to be very condensed. Right, these are the other some of the other camping hats I'm going to put in there. And then I need to redo all this. Organize my shoes that I've just been throwing over the top of the boxes because I couldn't reach over here. Haven't tackled that yet. Cleared some of this out and moved it around. So 
wanted you guys to kind of see the the mid-range of progress you can start seeing revealing what's behind there and i'm trying to get to some other stuff some totes that are back there too so i'm gonna keep plugging along but believe it or not this is progress and like i said this is going to take a long time to get this room i'm just getting at a starting point oh yeah my tapestry there that's hidden hmm all right so progress believe it or not here's all the boxes i've broken down i'm gonna get organized but all the boxes are down, and you can see my cool United States map I have there. And then we have another one back here behind this door. Um, we have this one behind. Then we also have this one behind the door. You can't see it too good because the camping piles here with my camping hats. So let me get all his boxes in a bag out there and continue organizing that. <laughs> All right, so that big bag here and all that is cardboard for my son so he can heat his house. I just let him know and he's happy. And pulled out this bin, which has a bunch of stuff that I probably do not want anymore. So I got to sit with that. And then I definitely don't want this anymore. So get rid of all that. All right, I emptied the bin. Those are going to be for dad's party when he comes home to us finally. We miss him so much. Donate. Donate. Recycling. Trailer. I need to clean that up. So that bin is empty and I'm moving right along. You can see, you can see the wall all better now. Still plugging away. That bin was in that far corner over there. And there's more stuff down in there. So here we go. All right, the day has come. I'm donating my artificial flowers. I don't make arrangements anymore. I don't do wreaths anymore. I'm moving on to other things. So I'm going to sell those. I don't ever use these dumbbells. I'm going to sell those or give those away. This is an old uh, racetrack of dad's that can go in this space here where those bins were. I'm not going to tackle this today. This is photo album and photo album stuff and craft stuff so that's for another day but i'm still working on this and it looks like a mess in here right now but trust me i am making headway oh i found more frames to save this one i'm getting rid of and i think i'll like this mirror for camping and possibly this um wooden carrying box for camping so that's where we're at and this is the camping pile that grows I'm not going to use all of it, but I want to, I want to have options and use what fits best. And you'll see that process as it goes. Okay. I'm going to take the tapestry down because I want to use this for camping. It's this awesome forest one. So for a while, all this ugliness is going to be visible until I get it reorganized. It's some of his chemicals, yearbooks, my scrapbooking tools, more craft stuff with a ribbon and stuff. So, and these are the hats that are not my camping hats these ones are in kind of better shape so i'm gonna keep those here and i have a really pretty sun hat that's colorful this one can be camping so plugging right along um i found these things for the rv these soft-sided totes another throw rug some fabric when i might need and i think it might be fun to possibly bring the picture frame thing this is randomness that i'm donating these are iron-ons, and then you can paint them on the fabric. I don't do that anymore. The bottom of a lava lamp. That part works. Lava lamp's done. Little crystal making kit. This will go with the flower making, and then some more randomness. Sorry. And this is the pile as it grows for what's going to go in that frame box. I knew I had more, so I'm doing it. This is a big job, but I can already see compared to before. Of course, these boxes, I need to condense and get back over there, but... I am making progress. Progress report. Emptied another tub. I'm in a lawsuit with my former employer and uh, this is all that stuff. I gotta find somewhere to put all that loveliness. Plugging along and I think I'm gonna keep these for now. And this, believe it or not, was my mother's. It's like those things you just can't get rid of. She keep, kept Q-tips and cotton balls and stuff. <laughs> Might be finally time I need to part with that. Look at all the VHS and DVDs I need to go through another day and more photo albums and all kinds of essential oil and crafting stuff. It just goes on and on. 
So now that I cleared this space, I'm gonna vacuum it up before I place anything back in that area. I'm a little out of breath. Then I gotta take the dog out. Alrighty, here's an update. Looking quite a bit better. This is hundreds and hundreds of dollars worth of fancy Kiwi Lane paper kits that I bought. I really need to get back to my scrapbooking. Gonna tuck those in here for now. And this is also for all my scrapbooking. And I also make personalized cards. So I have my stickers and pens and just all that in here. So that I do use. Still gotta organize these. Pretty sure I don't need this electric pencil sharpener anymore. I think I can donate that. Garbage, donate, donate, garbage. I used to save every essential oil bottle and I'm gonna start changing that. I don't need to save all these. I've got hundreds of them. So I'm purging this pile and things like that aren't easy for me. Don't ask me why. I think I lived in the depression in a former life or something, depression era. All right, so moving along. I've been doing this for hours. All right, making some progress. Got some stuff cleared. This stuff isn't as high up as it was. It, it's a work in progress. I can get to my shoes much better. And it's just not just a pile of shoes. My hats are here. I like to keep them in the plastic. I don't like dust all over them. Boxes are condensed as they can be. I condensed his stuff a little. I'm going to put the uh, room divider there for now. This corner I'll deal with another time. That's like our gifting corner. And the crock pot's probably going to end up being part of our um, camping situation. The stool will probably end up being part of camping too. And speaking of camping... This is where we're at with the pile of stuff that might work for camping. So I'm moving right along. All right, I'm as far as I can get on it today. I got other stuff I need to do, so. I didn't do much over there. It's mostly sorting, you know, just sorting through every little item that I dug out around. Cleared a little bit of space there, but I totally have to redo the office. I have to work on that essential oil stuff there. But that pile does look better. I love daddy's lamp that we got. Cleared that space a little. The scented oil stuff's a little better organized over there. And like I said, there's the camping pile so far. So I'm feeling accomplished. On to my next projects. And I'll work on this office slowly, but surely to eventually get it done. Oh, and I do believe this is all that's going to end up in the um, frame box. I think that's the pile, but I don't want to pack it till I know for sure. So, all right, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to stop and smell the flowers. There's some shit I like to fix, but I still know that I'm blessed.